So if you're trying to really level up your style and not break the bank, these next items are gonna help you do exactly that. So first up on the list, we have a steamer. Wrinkles just ruin an outfit. You got your clean button down shirt on, you got your suit on or something like that. And you got all these wrinkles going through it. It just ruins everything. Steamers will get those deep wrinkles out. They also help kill bacteria because of the steam and because of the steam from steamers, it actually helps eliminate odors too. Now I ain't saying just don't be washing your clothes and not doing your laundry, you're nasty. I'm just saying this is one more benefit of getting a steamer. So as you get older, you tend to get a little bit nicer shoes. You tend to spend a little bit more on the shoes and the types of shoes you wear. And for that, Number two is gonna be a shoe tree. A lot of people overlook shoe trees, but they actually do a lot. Now, the main purpose of a shoe tree is to keep the wrinkles and the creases out of your shoes, and they will help keep the shape of your shoes over time. Now, as you wear your shoes, they tend to absorb moisture, and the shoe tree, especially if you get a wooden one, will help keep that moisture and pull that moisture back into the shoe tree itself and keep your shoes looking nice and clean. Not only that, keeping moisture out helps with odors again. In 2020, things have gotten a little bit different to say the least and one of them is going to the barber a lot of the times you still can't go to the barber so you need a grooming kit you need just the basic grooming kit to help your beard and maybe even your line just stay looking a little bit good for those times you gotta squeeze in between the barbers when you just can't make it there especially i know some places it look it ain't looking too pretty for y'all right now y'all might be like that for a while so a grooming kit is just gonna help you look good and stay looking good through those extended periods of time. Number four is gonna be a set of wooden hangers. Now, you may be asking yourself, Chris, how are hangers gonna help me look better? The one of the main things is good wooden hangers won't leave lines or creases or unwanted folds in your garments over time. And just like the shoe trees, they actually help reduce odors and moisture in your closet. Plus, I'm not gonna lie, they just kinda make your, your closet look a little bit nice. Where am I liking? <laughs> Let's talk about number five, which is slim wallets. Now I'm not gonna lie, pulling these out of your pocket just look dope. They just look cool. You just whoosh, you pull it out, especially if you get one with the little bottoms that pop up in all the cards. You feel like, damn, what's going on over here? Slim wallets just look clean. They add to your overall appearance. I got mine for like only 20 bucks. You don't have to break the bank on it. Most of them actually come with the RFID protection. Basically the RFID just blocks any communications or anyone scanning your cards that are in your wallet, which is super useful, super protective. And it's just something that you need to do to be a responsible adult. Of course I say adult, oh high pitch, it's adult. I feel like a lot of people don't even know or haven't even heard of collar stays, but collar stays actually slide into your collar right here to keep them standing up straight and looking good. It's a finishing touch. It's not something that's gonna make a huge difference, but it is just gonna help your collars last longer because everybody knows if you got a few collar shirts in your closet over time, the they just start to fall and mend and kind of just get wrinkly and they don't look the same after a while. Collar stays help prevent that and they keep you looking sharp. If you're anything like me and you have more than three watches, your watches are probably all over the place all the time. And that's why number seven is a watch box. Just like in your closet, if you have everything in one spot where you can look at it, it's a lot easier to help put outfits together and just visualize how they're gonna look. Since I've gotten mine, I've actually been able to rotate through my watches a lot more regularly. I actually wear them in different styles now. Um, they're also gonna help keep your watches clean, free of dust, and operating like they should. I mean, you still gotta do your basic maintenance. Uh, what, you thought I didn't have one? No, did you? You thought I didn't have one? Oh, yeah. So number eight is a shoe shine kit. Pretty self-explanatory, right? You get, you got your nice dress shoes, you need to keep them looking nice over time. You're you're growing up now. And this, it doesn't even have to be a shoe shine, a shoe polish kit. It can just be a shoe cleaning kit. If you're not one to wear dress shoes or dress boots, you still need to keep those, you know, keep your Air Force Ones right. You gotta keep your dunks, you know, keep your ones looking good. You might as well not even waste your time putting on the rest of the outfit if you're gonna have some dirty shoes. But not only that, keeping up with your shoes and just cleaning them on a regular basis will extend the lifespan of your shoes. Okay, now here's one I think a lot of people overlook, and that is a nice daily carry bag. You don't have to spend a bunch of money to get a good looking bag that you're gonna carry on a daily basis. The one thing is, if you got a full-time job where you carry a briefcase or you carry a laptop bag or you're just, you're just a 
commuter or you know digital nomad or something like that one of the things people are going to see you with on a daily basis is the bag that you carry your equipment and your stuff around in so it might as well look good just get something that's quality made and looks nice but most importantly serves its purpose for you i have a camera bag I have a laptop bag. I have, you know, small overnight bags. If I'm just going somewhere for a weekend, you don't have to be like me and have three different ones for all types of other stuff. And finally, number 10 is a quality watch. Come on, y'all. I know, I know. Go figure. Who, who would have guessed? This one's probably my favorite because most guys think you gotta go out and buy a Rolex just to get a nice watch, which is not the case. There are some amazing watches out there for under $100. Hell, this watch I have on my wrist right now, I've had for two years, haven't had a single problem with it, and it was $42, I think, when I got it. Watches really change the look of an outfit. They convey maturity without saying anything, especially if you get you a nice dress watch. And if there is one big reason to get a watch, I think it just makes you look a little bit more suave, a little bit more smooth. And that's gonna wrap it up for this one, guys. Um, as always, I hope this helps, and I will see you in the next one.